That life is nice, six point five million years old. How do you get life out of no life? Answer that question. Ladies, you think about it, we've got life in the world. You can't tell me. What is life? Life is what we've got. What you do is you reflect on life. Does your life suck What is life? Hey, don't sing it rain. Don't sing it rain. We're having a good day till you show up. Now look, all I'm saying, folks, is that man said to me, he's a physicist. And I asked him a simple question. I'll ask it you. You've got a brain. I'm speaking in English. It's not a foreign language. You've all got it, yeah? How do you get life from no life? No one knows. You don't know? No one knows. Okay. Why do you say nobody knows? Well, you, uh, you, do you know? Yes. Go on, then. Well, I would go to the person who was there. So you it, don't know that, then. But hang on a minute. No, well, hang on a minute. The person who was there... It's Jesus. You, All you things don't know were made that, by him. Without him, nothing was made that was made. Yeah, but you, that's, you're getting out from the box. Well, what's wrong with that? You, you didn't say it. No, I didn't say I did. I said that Jesus, who said, I it's am the just, truth, I cannot lie. It's just your idea. Now, let me ask you a question, sir. In your life, have you ever done anything that Jesus wouldn't be happy with? Have you committed adultery? Uh, I've done things that I'm yeah. not happy with. Yeah. Okay, you've Never mind, Jesus. And me too. But Jesus Christ tells us this, that no liar can enter heaven. Now, no liar gets into heaven. The last page of the Bible, book one. Will you get in? No liar, one lie makes you a liar. I don't, you I don't how how do you know you're not lying about what you're speaking about right yeah. now? Well, have you told a lie? Of course I have. So it's true, isn't it? So you're gonna go, are you going to heaven? I am, but I'm not going because I've told a lie. Well, who told you that you're not lying about what you're saying right now? Well, Jesus said this. No, 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 no. Are you, are you, are you, are you, is Jesus a friend of yours? He is. He's a friend of yours? He is. Right, so you speak to him on, on a do. daily basis. I met him today, I spoke to him you today. Him. Yeah. So you're a liar. Why? Because apparently he's not here. Well, how do you know he's you're... not here? How do you Jesus know he Christ. is? Well, listen, let me just say this to you. I'll show you his. See this man here, come and stand here. Now, where, ask where, him. Where, where, where's your friend come from? Where have you brought him in the same train as you come from? Well, he's come from Africa. Well, ask him. I He'd be Africa. courteous to him. I mean, he's from Africa. He'd be courteous. How do you know he's from Africa? You've only just met him. Or have you brought him on the where train? Where are you from? I, I am from Africa. Oh, you I'm presumed from. he's from Africa because of the colour of his skin, have you now? Yeah. Is that not a racist thing? Are you not a liar? I've spoken before. He knows me from... Ah, from oh, you spoke before? Oh, so you know each other? Yes. So you want to preach in front of all of these people about something you pull out of a crowd? That all of a sudden well, now you, he's met you, you before. You choose somebody in the crowd and I'll interview them. What? No, no, you no, no, no. He just told you, you that he's met them. you before. All right, right. just turn you back down here. Come on, man, come on. You just yeah. said that you've yeah. met you I before. Hey, I'm from this man. Hey, I'm from this man. Well, of course okay, you can. Where's he, where's he from? Well, I don't know. I'm oh, you don't him. know because he's not he's not coloured, so you don't know he's from Africa. So you're not a racist? <laughs> what? <laughs> Sir, we've all got I know you've met each other before. So, so now you bring somebody to one of your preachers, no, no, and now saying, you know him. Sir, I don't know why you're having a pop at me. All I'm, I'm saying, not having a pop at you. You, you, are, you a can't pop. pull somebody into a crowd that you already know. You're saying on some. You're saying that I'm telling lies because you said earlier, how do you know I'm not lying? I'm how saying. How do you know he's from Africa? Because he's a friend of mine. So you bring him around to preach to all of these people. No. I'll have a chat to him if you want to be thinking ask him, correct. Ask him. But I'm asking you to choose somebody who I don't know out here and I'll interview them. Go on. Okay, go on. Choose. Would you like to come and stand? No. 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 Correct. Okay. Lady, would you like to come stand in front of me? Right. 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 Okay, now listen. This man. Babe, sure. Yeah, I'm not that lady. That lady. That lady. I'm not. I'm not a lady either. I'm a, I'm a man. I'm not a lady. <laughs> Now look, I was going to ask that man there the question. His friend. It's friend. Nice. It's you, the gentleman who shows, so thank you for choosing me. All right? Um, tell us your name. Jill. Jill, can you tell me in your life and in your life? Yes. So, if your mum was here, would she back that up? Oh, yes. So you know you can tell lies? Yeah, no. In the last page of the Bible, book one, does it say no liar can enter heaven, yes or no? Yes. Are you going to heaven? Yes. Well, you can't do, you're Jesus isn't the God. Why, why, why is she a liar? Because she just told you. You asked her the question. Well, you don't Have you to told heaven. lies? She said yes, and therefore she's a liar. She's not allowed to go exactly. to heaven. Exactly, you're right. You believe in that. You you no, the reason she's going to heaven, sir, is <laughs> because there's another way and it's called forgiveness. <laughs> So even no, though no, I've no. told lies... You need to make one, two, one of two things. If you're a liar, you're a liar. Yes. If you're a liar, you're not going to 
going to heaven. But you can be a forgiven liar. Wow. See what I mean? All you do is you chat shit. All I'm, all I'm, that's all it is, is you chat shit. <laughs> no, because you, you, you make an excuse for everything that you do in life. Jill, Jill, you said that you told lies. Yes. And I said hey, in the last page of the Bible, um, it says no liar can enter heaven. But if you join with us all on your own, you're on the arm. Right? It's those of you practice lying all the time. Well, Jesus said no liar can enter heaven. <laughs> no, no liar. No liar. So there's something that gets forgiven can go. Are you, uh, is every single person here allowed to be forgiven? Yes. So we all go to No. Because we make your fucking mind up. No, no, no. Everybody here is allowed to be forgiven. Allowed to be, but it doesn't mean they are. Why, Why not? Who makes that decision? Who You'll get better, decision? and you don't take the medicine, but the medicine's there. Why, what, Do you get better? Why are you no, forgiven? Why not? Why is it Why are you forgiven? Thank you for the question. No, no, no you're not answering the question. Okay. Well, I'll tell you. Sit and you <laughs> preach. You sit and you answer preach the to everybody. Answer the so question. Is everybody here allowed to be forgiven? If they come to Jesus, yes. So everyone can be a liar. Then we're all off. Jesus, you just said you're not a liar. I am. I mean, you've been forgiven. I've been forgiven. Everyone can be forgiven. It can be, but so it doesn't mean they are. You, who needs you to sit and preach when we're all get forgiven? We don't all forgiven. Forgive. No, we don't all get forgiven. You just said we're all get forgiven. No, I said we all ah, really get forgiven. We all can lie. Ladies and gentlemen, think about it. If I've got no, some medicine and I say this medicine will make you better, if you don't take the medicine, even though it'll make you better, it means you could have. <laughs> you could have been forgiven, cleansed, but you didn't take the medicine. Make your mind up. So the gentleman so don't just sit and waste your time and listen to what you've got to say, because we can all lie and we all get permission. No, forgiven. that's wrong. Yes. I'm not saying that. You've just agreed with what no, I said. Yeah. Listen, 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 listen. I'm saying. You me, just agree. Look, I'm saying we have all told lies. Right? Okay. Me too. I'm also saying that for each one of us, Jesus is willing to forgive us, but it means us to accept the forgiveness. So the man thought that just because it was available, it became his. Just because it's available, it doesn't become yours. It's not about Jesus, though. It's about faith. It's about faith. Jesus. It's about. Yeah, but it must be Jesus. The world is 66 million years old. How do you know? How do you know? How do you know? How do you know? I believe in. I have faith. Yeah. Not in Jesus, I have faith in life. I have faith in me kids. As long as we have faith, it doesn't matter who Jesus Why is, the food is, anyone, no one. As long as you've got faith, you're happy. End of. Ladies and gentlemen, if I tell them that building there and I have faith that I'll do a jump off and bang my head on the floor and I'll be fine, will I be fine? I'll be ignorant. You're right. You're right. I'm right. I might have faith with it. Yes, I really believe it. But ladies and gentlemen, what happens is this. You've got to have faith in the right person. Why, why? Jesus said, I'm the only one who can take you to heaven. Yeah? Wow. One, one question. Uh, one, just yeah, and then yours. So thank you, all your questions. And thank you to the man who said yours. Thank you. Why are you forgiving us? Why are you forgiving us? The gentleman asked me, thank you for the question. You said, why am I forgiven? Ladies and gentlemen, all I can tell you is when I was 19, I realised I wasn't forgiven. And they told me that on the cross, Jesus took my sin. And because he's taken my sin and he's died in my place, he says, if you come to me, I'll not turn you away. So I'm forgiven. I've come to an invisible, but real person called Jesus Christ, and he's forgiven me. That's what happened. Right, so you have someone who lives a whole life. Oh, she's Jesus. He's a really good person. There's I, nobody I, I, that no, no, but you know yeah. what I mean. In, in theory, you can argue Charitable, that there's nobody is. Nice yeah. person, do good yeah. things. Yeah, yeah. Don't accept Jesus. Yeah. Go into hell. The Bible says this. Yeah, you get someone on death row, rape, kill children, despicable. But are you really saying there's minute, anybody who's a really nice person? Set Jesus, uh, well, think, yeah, but think about this. Think about this. Really Let's say you're a ten and you've only told one lie for every month you've lived. You're on 120 lies. You're only ten and you've only told one every month you've lived. No great revelation. There's no people. That you Jesus said no man is good. There's nobody good. He said if you want to get to heaven, you can either be perfect, which we can't. 
but he hung on a cross publicly, spat upon. He said, which one of you convinces me of sin? They spat on him, they put a crown of thorns in his head, a spear through his side, and the Son of God died in agony, screaming, my God, why have you forsaken me? And in those moments, ladies and gentlemen, he died to get you out of your grave. Talk to the atheist, he'll say there's nothing next. Jesus said it's appointed unto man once to die and after this a judgment and there's an eternal death. If you want to go with a fellow who's having a pop at me and stick with your eternal death, fine, walk on. But I've tried to get you out of the grave. And Jesus says, I love you, I'll forgive you, I'll cleanse you. And the reason I do this and people think we're off our tree, they thought Einstein was off his tree. They thought all brilliant men, some of them were totally off the tree. But they were brilliant, people wouldn't listen. Now look, I'm going to finish there, and can I take your question, sir? One more question, what can I just say at the end? Yes, and the ladies too, if you talk to that lady. Yes. Yes. Yes, other than Jesus, you're right, the ladies made a great point. Yes, you're right. You said, why is Jesus called? The heart of civilization You've got to please God. Remember what the father said? He said, this is my well-beloved son, you my well pleased. He can't say that about me. I've done wrong. Jesus loved me and died for me. And he's willing to let me off. And he's willing to let me off. I've got nothing to get off. Oh, well. Sorry. Yes. My question is changed. Where is that? Now, he thought about the Einstein and saying, we've got Socrates and we've got other people. Yes. Yes. Because they believed at the time. Yes. We're saying the world was not the stars around the planet. And other people believed. But you were essentially proven to be wrong. But this is why they were really wrong. Yes. Now, what is the argument to say that such a person is right or right. wrong? You can't compare this. You can't okay. say okay. that. Okay. Okay. Well, I think it's cancer, but let me just yeah, yeah. look. Do you think that the Twin Towers, when they flew the plane, and murdered all those people? Do you think that was right or wrong? Well, yeah, it is. It is, but you said... Well, I'm going to say this. Everybody knows that when that guy stabbed that whoever it was on the train yesterday, that he's wrong. Because murder's wrong. Yeah, the Twin Towers murder. It's wrong. So whether, whatever stage you live in history, as you we know there's rights and wrongs. And listen, right, that's a great question. Thank you. If the gentleman said, why do we need Jesus and God anyway? Listen, folks, me and you, and I'm talking about me, I've done wrong. I have. But Jesus loved me enough to get me forgiven. Because beyond the grave, there's an eternal judge. So if I were to count yes. all the night, kill you, and then go to church and ask forgiveness, I would still get to heaven. No. No, 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 you won't. Why not? I, I, I because, because, because to become a Christian, you've got to be serious. And if you're not serious, no, you're doing exactly. your own thing. Yeah. What if I'm already Christian? You don't know me, sir. Well, I don't, but are you a Christian? No, my question now. Yeah, how did you become a Christian? I have So then you're not right one now. then? No, I don't have Sorry to interrupt the last yes, night, but you, you get multiple, you get um, yeah. serial killers. Yes. Okay. Well, you see, what you've got to remember is don't be gullible. You can't pick and choose who goes to you. No, I don't. So, so, the answer, look, you Billy, let's have a look. Billy, come and join me here. This is my friend. Think about the same. One, one before, just before we go, and ladies and gentlemen, can I thank this gentleman and the man in his absence, wherever he is, and the lady here, and this gentleman for the questions, and this man who nearly got interviewed on his bike. Thank you. But at the end, I'm going to offer everybody a gospel job. One more Listen, point. Yeah, I will. Let, let me just offer that. If a person acts good that only problem. because of the, uh, the promise of divine rewards, yeah. what you have is not a good person. You have a selfish person. A person should be good without the promise of reward. I do not kill you because I hope to get to heaven. I do not kill you because it's the right thing well, to do. Well, Jesus said no man is good, so you're right. Well, right. I am not God. Despite no. the fact that I do not worship Jesus. No, you've got to be perfect to get to heaven. It's not whether you're good. Oh, we have to be perfect. Yeah, and we right. can't be. That's so why Jesus on the cross. Hell, no one's perfect. That's why Jesus on the cross. Jesus said, Jesus and Dad, Dad alone you've got forever. You shouldn't be up here telling me that's my message. No, We're because not I don't need to tell people how they live their lives. I don't and judge Jesus people. And Jesus loves you enough at the cross, though. 
it. And the gentleman is, I'm giving you a little gospel to anybody who read it. In John 10, 10, it's in here. I've come that you may have life. Folks, you've got to beat your grave. It's waiting for you. And they'll say nice things about you, but ultimately you need to know you're safe in eternity. That booklet is for anybody who'll take it and read it. God, say, God right. bless you. Thank you very much for your time. Not good for just for divine rewards, they are good for being good. Okay. It's good you do not need to be the good. promise of heaven to be a good person. But you won't get there, it's a place for perfect people. Yeah, but even though even them gospels, good. it's only the gospel according to John, isn't it? Well, it's Jesus. According to Matthew. Well, and what else would you put? Well, if, if someone else wrote it at the time, it'd be the gospel according well, there is to four, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. just their point of view. I know, view. but they were there. You don't know whether, you, yeah, but you don't know whether what well, I'm listen, telling you is right. Why don't you read it and tell me where its fallacies are? No, but you don't. I could. Yeah, if I copy. was living then, yeah. you could yeah. have the gospel according to me. You could. But it won't say that what I write is right. No, oh, but so Jesus, but right. Jesus, what well, happens? Message but right. if you read it, you'll know whether it's true. Have you read it? There's 21 chapters. How many have you read? I've, I've read quite a bit. Well, then, what's in chapter one? Oh, I don't know. It. I'm what's I'm in like chapter that. two? Yeah, yeah, I don't know. So, so hold on, sir. Creation. Well, that, that's Go not ahead. my Creation. point. Uh, no, no, you, ask, you, you would ask Creation, him, you, I've just oh, told you. But what if, you would ask him for further details, so please elaborate. My, my, my point yes, isn't that you don't know the Bible, right? I'm not no, disputing no, it's fine. that. It's fine. But it's just a gospel according to someone. I know, but all I'm So it's just his point of view of what well, happened at the time. It is, it, it could is. be wrong, he might have It could be wrong, somewhere. you're right, it could so be to wrong. Hold, to put everything... You are right, it could be wrong. But as you read it, you'll find Jesus saying, I am the truth. Now look, that man, John, this is my friend Billy. All right, now Billy... I'm not going to go into too much detail, but you went to prison. Did you go for prison for... Did somebody leave this world as a result of you, your misdemeanors? Yep. Now that could be anything, that could be a mission of healthcare. More well, well, it could be, it could be. But Billy, has God forgiven you? Yep. Now look, did you, were you in prison when you got there? Yep. Were you in the maze? No, we're not saying you can get forgiven in the street. You are permitted to because that is the way out of it. <laughs> you are. I'm not saying. I'm saying love your enemies. That's what Jesus said. What's wrong with that? No, what now, you're saying is this man is a case of someone who has <laughs> well, committed crime and then been let off. Have you, have, have you never been? Have you never committed a crime? Have you committed adultery? Have you looked on a woman lustfully? Yes, you know. Any person no, 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 here don't over the age of 12 say you. otherwise. We're talking about you. I have looked at many women that well, you, 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 you committed adultery, like me. And we're saying we're forgiven. Billy's been and done some big bad things. I've done some bad things. We've done wrong. And if you don't want to be forgiven, stay as you are. You're going to death, won't you? That's a great question saying they've done wrong and they haven't. Well, have you never done wrong? No. Oh. Well, God says no man... There's no other people who don't tell lies. I don't tell lies and I don't do wrong. So you've never done wrong? No. In all your life? Yeah. How do you know? Is a I know. Excuse me. Okay. Oh. Ladies respected. and gentlemen, I'm just going to stop there. If anybody would like a Gospel of John, please come and take it. Thank you again to my friend. Thank you to Alan. I'll get your question in a moment, buddy. And that's it. Thank you to the lady there. Billy, if you could just hold those, they can take them out of your hand. If anybody would like one, please take it, folks, and read it.